an angle measures the amount of turn. As the angle increases, the name changes. An acute angle is less than 90 degrees. A right angle is 90 degrees exactly. An obtuse angle is greater than 90 but less than 180 degrees. A straight angle is 180 degrees exactly. A reflex angle is greater than 180 degrees. And a full rotation is 360 degrees exactly. This diagram might make it easier to remember. Also, acute, obtuse and reflex are in alphabetical order. And the letter A has an acute angle. Be careful what you measure. Here is an obtuse angle, and a reflex angle. But the lines are the same, so when naming the angles make sure that you know which angle is being asked for. Positive and negative angles. When measuring from a line, a positive angle goes counterclockwise, opposite direction that clocks go. A negative angle goes clockwise. Example, this angle is minus 67 degrees. Parts of an angle. The corner point of an angle is called the vertex, and the two straight sides are called arms. The angle is the amount of turn between each arm. How to label angles. There are two main ways to label angles. Give the angle a name, usually a lowercase letter like A, or B, or sometimes a Greek letter like alpha or theta. Or by the three letters on the shape that define the angle, with the middle letter being where the angle actually is, its vertex. Example. Angle A is BAC, and angle theta is BCD.